as we now look at the last area of building the work of God, doing our part of building the work through service. And um, boy, no better way to serve than to be an example of what it is to serve. And uh, you can point people every single day of your life to the way they ought to go, and it won't have near the effect as when you show people how to do it. And, um, and so we want to be that example in the area of service. So we're going to go back to Luke chapter 7. Luke chapter 7. And I'm just going to read a couple of verses here in Luke 7. And, uh, and then I'm not going to recap everything. We are just going to get down. I'll give you the headings of each section we've hit so far just in case you, you missed one of them, uh, you'll be able to write it down if you're taking notes. But uh, we got two more areas to look at concerning um, this, this lady that has um, shown humility and has shown herself a servant to the Lord in washing his feet, in showing uh, how much she appreciates who he is and what he has done for her. And uh, we're going to see two more aspects of what this um, presentation of what she did, what it presents to us as an example of service and how we ought to live in service for the Lord ourselves. And so Luke chapter 7, looking at starting verse number 36, and uh, we will just read down to verse number 38. It says, and one of the Pharisees desired him that he would eat with him, and he went.